of it. You hired me because you wanted law, you wanted order around TNA. Look no further. That's what I'm here to do. Tonight, I'm personally going to see to it that I referee the match between Stan Word or Next week, there's going to be a trained chimp doing your job around here. I'm going to go see if we got a referee shirt that'll fit your big frame. <laughs> JB, I already got one. Custom made and all. Tonight, Christian Cage wants to threaten Matt Morgan. We're damn sure going to see who gets the last laugh. Wow, how convenient to have a referee shirt. Time to check out yet another date in the courtship between Black Machismo and SoCal Val. This is like the jacuzzi, right? Yeah, jacuzzi's real beautiful. Almost as beautiful as you. Yeah, I would have took you to my own at home, but uh, I don't really have one. Plus, the hotel jacuzzi's a lot cheaper, you know? Especially when you don't check in, you know, with water bills and everything. Now, I uh, think we should talk. I mean, we've been on a couple dates. Went to Universal Studios. We went to eat. We even worked out together for my escape match at Lockdown. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. I mean, I think it's time we took this to the next level. What do you say? Thank you, my boy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guys. Sanjay. How's it going? Wow, Val, look what at you. What are you doing here? Let me see that bikini. What it's like a snake or something. Now, snake. The snake in here. Let me see that. Robert. Three challengers have qualified for the X Division title match at lockdown. It's time to determine who Black Machismo's fourth opponent will be. Just say it. <laughs> say my name. Prime time, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, the next match on TNA Impact is a lockdown escape qualifying match scheduled for one fall. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, Prime Time, Big Skipper. What's the story with the guru, Sanjay Dutt? All of a sudden appearing at all of these dates between Black Machismo and SoCal Val. Always at the right place at the right time, it seems. Just stop a little of the magic. And his opponent from the deep blue sea, Shark Boy! April 13th at lockdown. It's the X Division title on the line in the escape match in the six sides of steel. We have already qualified. Three men, three individuals as challengers for Black Machismo, Jay Lethal, full belt, already set. Curry Man, the guru himself, Sanjay Dutt, and Johnny Devine. And now, will it be Primetime Elix Skipper or Shark Boy, who is number four? It looks like Primetime going right after that opportunity for the title on the attack very early. Well, great opportunity here for Primetime Elix Skipper to get himself back to that extra division title hunt. And you know Shark Boy with his new attitude wants to show the world how for real he is. Both of them trying to get in to the escape match, the escape estimated championship match, where the six guys will be inside the six sides of steel. And whoever can make it out first, whoever can use that athletic ability to climb that cage and hit the floor will become the X Division champion and will Black Matisse will be able to retain. From the middle rope, Shark Boy catches nothing but canvas on the way down as Skipper rolls out of the way and then what a quick kick that was by Primetime right into the head of Shark Boy. And you can see how dazed he is. Want to remind you, still to come, yes, Kurt Angle promises that he will make Samoa Joe back up his promise, back up his words that he'll retire, leave professional wrestling forever if he doesn't win the TNA World's title at our lockdown pay-per-view event. Don't know exactly what he has in store. Plus, Scott Steiner. He says that tonight's the night that he's going to let the world know about cashing in that title shot that he earned at Feast or Fired and James Storm one-on-one -on -one against Sting in a main event matchup that has revenge written all over it. How in the world is Matt Morgan going to be able to keep that under control? How is he going to be fair and impartial? I mean, you mentioned how convenient to have your referee shirt already ready anticipating it. I'll tell you something. Never have trusted him, but I will say this. There is no way when you see how vulnerable it is between Team Cage and Team Tonko that Matt Morgan can keep things on the up and up. Prime time Elix Skipper really taking it. 
to Shark Boy. The amazing transformation that we've seen from Shark Boy over the course of the past few months, trying to be derailed, and just when Skipper tried to walk the ropes, Shark Boy cuts him off, and then he just drilled him with a drop kick. I'll tell you what, when you make that decision to walk those ropes, you've got to go for it. You've got to be, your timing's got to be right. Shark Boy able to catch just enough breath to see it coming and then where can he and Skipper go from that? You don't have good balance up there. Maybe this will give Shark Boy a chance to get things turned around. Winner of this matchup, yes, becomes yet another challenger for the X Division champion in that escape match against Jay Lethal, Black Machismo. Who's it going to be? Shark Boy set off into the ropes, comes right off, fills press, follow up a series of shots, big right hands, and then takes prime time right by the head and pounds him right down against the canvas, right off the ropes, drops down with the elbow across the chest and face. I'll tell you what, he's just being vicious right now, just using brutal physicality. Just not trying to finesse even Skipper right here, just trying to send a message that he's going to pummel him and get that victory that way. But Elix Skip, oh, he went for the spin kick, but look at this. Oh, man. It was blocked. Shark Boy powers him down, right on him for the pin, and only a two count. Shark Boy right there looks up and can't believe it. Phoenix Skipper was able to get the shoulder up just in time, but you can feel it right now. The crowd behind him, he's getting that momentum. But Elix Skipper, we know one thing about him. He's as athletic as anybody in TNA, and there he shows it right there. He shows that straight. Hangs Shark Boy across the top rope. Gonna sit back here and head up to the top. Gonna try and measure him for a leap oh, across the ring. And God. oh, what a great extension with that guillotine leg drop. I tell you what, he didn't wait. Two. Oh, I thought the Skipper was moving on. To the Escape Lockdown match, to the Escape Championship, to the Escape Championship and Lockdown. But instead of walking the road, he just leaped all the way. Oh, how about Shark Boy, though? Kicking at the foot and bringing Skipper down. Great timing with that drop kick type move. Skipper touched up on the top turnbuckle. Shark Boy, big shot that time. Open hand, knife edge chop to the chest. Gonna go right up to the top. Follow up, Skipper trying to fight him off. Shark Boy, Hurricane Rana back in from the top. Shark Boy snapping the Hurricane Rana off. Just bring out a whole array of different moves you didn't see. And there you go. There you go. One, two, done. Here's your winner. Shark Boy hits the chummer, and he defeats primetime Elix Skipper in the process. He's done it. He will move on to our lockdown pay-per-view as one of the challengers when the X Division title's on the line, and it looks like he's going to down some of the clam juice. Oh, it's time to celebrate his Shark Boy getting a chance to be actually a part of the X Division championship as he now. And let's review. We now know that Black Machismo, Curry Man, Guru, Johnny Devine, and now Shark Boy will be in the X Division escape match. On that note, to Crystal with TNA knockout Tracy Brooks. Tracy, it's been a few weeks since that station X, and I've got to ask you, how's your back healing? How's my back? Crystal, do you see the bruises? No. Do you see the welts? Mm -mm. That's right, because bruises disappear and welts go away. But what Robert Roode and Payne Beggs did to me at Destination X is etched in my brain forever. Robert Roode inches from my face laughing at me. The sound of Payne Banks laughing as she whipped me with that unforgiving leather over and over again. So Payne Banks tonight, you and I get to get in that ring. This is not an athletic competition. This is payback. And payback is a bitch. And so are you. Oh, please. Blah, blah, blah. That's a blah. pretty big talk, blah. considering you're picking on a valet who isn't even a wrestler. Yeah. You know what, Tracy? Velvet and I are so sick and tired mm -hmm. of you acting like you're the mother hen around here. Nice. Like you're some veteran who can just boss oh, everybody yeah. around. Now, tonight, you have a match. So we'll give you a pass. But if you don't watch your back, you're going to end up just like Roxy. Yeah. Laid out. Still to come. Cowboy James Storm battles the icon Sting. But up next, Tracy Brooks takes on Peyton Banks. Sharkboy, congratulations. Both you and Curry Man have qualified for the escape match at Lockdown. Now, the rules for this escape match are pretty easy. There's going to be six guys. The first